you know, obviously we talked a little bit about Tom Woods and, and uh, Scott Horton and stuff, mm-hmm. but who are some of your favorite philosophers that you, you know, read while you're coming up? Uh, of anarchism? Oh, I, I will. Rothbard is definitely right there, right? Rothbard. And then um, uh, Lysander Spooner, Benjamin Tucker. Uh, Emma Goldman is actually a really great one. She's a, she was an anarcho-communist, but she has a lot of really uh, interesting stuff to say. And I think uh, other libertarians could actually get a lot out of her work. Um, Voltaire Declare, she's a great one. Um, uh, yeah, just even even anarchists, you know, you don't necessarily disagree. You don't necessarily agree with like uh, Bakunin. I think it's important to like you know branch out and read the I, read like I you enjoyed, know, something. Yeah, I enjoyed reading Bakunin and Proudhon and stuff yeah. like that too. I'm you know I'm, I'm pretty uh, you know what people would consider a right anarchist, anarcho capitalist, whatever you want to call it. I just say anarchism this day, these days because yeah. I'm gonna. I gotta tell some of you ANCAPs, man. You have made, you've made it hard to call myself an ANCAP to normal people. You know what I mean? <laughs> yes. Lo- love you to death, but Jesus, calm down. Right. Uh, um, yeah. But yeah, I've read I've read a lot of that stuff too, and I actually wrote a paper on this uh, when I when I was still with Think Liberty called "Why Philosophy Matters." Because if you're mm-hmm. going to argue uh, your philosophy against someone else's philosophy, it usually That's helps right. to understand that philosophy. But I noticed, yeah, exactly. Um, I noticed on on Twitter you just call yourself a market an- anarchist. Yeah. So, um, I didn't know like if you were, you know, like a Murray Rothbard anarchist or if you were a Proudhon, like mutualist or, you know, cause a lot of mutualists I, call themselves market anarchists. So. Right. Right. I just call myself market anarchist because I don't, I don't really, I'm not a big fan of the term capitalism in discourse because I think it like usually obscures, um, like language, like philosophically speaking, I think it obscures a lot of language. Um, I, I'm definitely more on the Rothbard. I'm definitely more closer to Rothbard than, uh, Proudhon, but, uh, yeah, that, that's just essentially why I don't call myself an ANCAP. <laughs> 